Hi there, this is my Gotham Before the Legends Season 1 set by Cryptosyke Entertainment and this is produced in 2016. This is the binder for the set and I get my checklist from Jeff Allender's House of Checklists. This is the base set. I've gone quite extensively into this set as you'll see. Not as much so for season two. Then you've got the chase set of character cards. Then you've got the chase set of quote cards. And this set of four picture set. And then you move into the autograph cards. I've got a variant on that one where he's written down his character name. And I have these variant cards by Claire who plays Ivy. And she's chosen to put little emoji signs on them. So I've got a few of those. And of course the normal signature card. And you've got Edward Nigma, who plays the Riddler. So he's got his little question mark. And then I've got this character, Dash, who has put things like Be Well and Best and Much Love so they're all variants in the set got Aaron Richards as Barbara and then of course Drew as Butch this is another variant I've got of a uh, minor character Michelle Tom is the actress name her character was all to do with birds And you've got the Robin Lord Taylor's penguin, Alfred, and then Todd I've done two different autograph cards, and then he's done this little variant with the mask, which is his character name. Then I move on to the costume cards. And there's a variant on the penguin one there. You've got a green and blue and a blue version. And then on his one there was a patch on it, his armbands as he was the prison officer. So there's just the normal version. There's one with part of the patch there. And then another one with a lot of the patch. And then I believe there was a patch on the other side of his arm as well. So that's a slightly different patch. Then you've got this one, the blood variant for his t-shirt. Same again, blood variant on Edward Nigma's t-shirt and on Fish Moonies as well as the base version and then a couple of the blood variants and then on Cameron Bike and Dover's you've got the normal version and then the black and white version and then on Marina Bacara and Leslie Tompkins you've got the normal version and the blood spattered version And then on Barbara Keane, you've got the normal version and the blood spat version, which obviously shows the series is quite violent. You've got the dual costume cards, which uh, again I've got another version thereof. And there's the seam on that one, which is classed as a variant. I believe there might even be a little bit of blood variant as well on that one. And then you've got the triple cards. And then you've got the Cameron Bike and Over, which wasn't part of the set. Sign card. Also in this set there was a Redemption, but I haven't managed to pick that up. And then also you've got printing plates that were done in this set. I have got a bit extreme and got quite a few. So they did the black version, the magenta version, the cyan version and the yellow version. And I believe there should be four per card that was in the set. See there, I've got black, blue and yellow of all the same card. I've got a few where you've got 
both are the same one. There's another one of a set of three, the black, the magenta and the cyan. Black, cyan and yellow on that one. And there's the checklist for the set done in red. Another set of three there. Blacks are always the most detailed. You can really see what the card looks like in that. You've got the chase. Managed to pick up a set of four for that chase, which is quite nice. And then the costumes, which are slightly more faded just because they were a more limited print run. But you can still see the cards. Unfortunately, some of them, when they printed the back of it on there, it's obviously stuck to the next card when they've done it. So you do get a couple that are slightly damaged by that. But the black ones have all the detail in it. And then the dual ones I've got a few of. And I've managed to get the triples. One of each one. And then there's the binder exclusive costume card, and then the promo cards, and then they also did this metal version of the promo cards, so that's both for that one. There's both for his one, both for Selena Carl's version, and then these ones they just did on their own without the metal. And then also in this set they did a foil shiny version of the base so I managed to pick up a full set of those his autograph just because he was also in the set and it was cheap to pick up so that's from Heroes. So the only thing missing in this set is the redemption card by Rittenhouse Archives and then the card you sent in to claim the redemption card which would be limited in two. One of those has been found I know and is on Facebook group and the other one went unclaimed so I believe the date for picking that one up has been cancelled. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed.